welcome back. Today I want to um, do a video that it's not going to be actually a review, but it's going to be more information about how to adjust the shade of your foundation. I feel like um, there's a lot of products that promise to do that, and I think that the Cover FX brand with the custom, I'm going to look up the name, Custom Cover Drops was one of the first ones that I've noticed in the market or one of the most hyped products, but that product is $44, and the one thing that it didn't make me want to buy it it wasn't only the price because i can get a foundation a really high-end foundation for that price but it's just because the fact that it does have a lot of shades and that would be a really good thing for some people but for me it's kind of hard if you have a yellow undertone skin or if you have um olive undertones it is kind of hard to find the perfect foundation for you because they are either orange or you know they're not they just don't go perfectly with your undertone and especially for me being latina it's not like the easiest task to find the perfect color for my skin so i always wonder about this kind of drops and things to change the shade of your foundations and when i saw that the body shop which i've never tried anything from them before they were in optally um i'll link the website in the description box down below but basically they sent me this so i can try it and review it for you guys but i just want to share with you my experience with them and um a little bit of why I think or for who this would be something amazing. Now at the moment I'm trying to finish this foundation. This is the Maybelline Superstay Makeup in the color Natural Tan. This is a really nice formula. I love this formula because I think it's very comparable to my MAC Pro Longwear. It really is. But this color in particular it's very dark. So once I saw this I was like well maybe I should try this product and see if I can make it work. The number one thing that it Made me want to try it instead of the cover effects one it's because the body shop it has a lightening one and the darkening one so it's not like I have to pick you know the perfect undertone or the perfect color to make my foundations larger la lighter or darker it's just foolproof you want it lighter then you get the lightening one do you want it darker then you get the darkening one it's like easier than find the perfect shade for me because if i'm saying that finding the perfect foundation shade for me is hard then finding something that it's gonna you know make my foundation work and find the perfect color to make it work and that is kind of a hassle can you do that with a lighter foundation or with a darker foundation absolutely but you're not gonna get the same results or i wasn't able to do that i have a project pan that i'll link up here i was trying to make a foundation by physicians formula work for me because it was too light and i tried to mix it with different um, darker foundations and it just didn't work because of the ingredients that they have they don't mesh well well with each other so I had to end up applying a lot of bronzer which you can do but I feel like it's not the same as having something specifically for that purpose now the lightning color as you can see it's like a white color it's um, off white color and it does have this dropper and you just get it and you apply one drop if you want a half shade lighter now the same thing with the darkening one and this is a very neutral chocolate brown it doesn't have you know warm undertones or anything it's more neutral so i feel that like you can darken your foundation without making it look orange or red or anything like that this is the perfect color for it which i was kind of scared because when i saw it online i thought that it looked a little bit orange but once you see it in real life this is a really nice and neutral darker color to kind of darkening your foundation or lightening with this white one now i tried it with the maybelline one and you're gonna see a demo so hopefully you can tell how much you can lighten your foundation and it does really lighten and you can make it match your skin you can also darken other foundations i've done it and it does work pretty much the same way i feel like it does need less of the darkening probably because of the shades that i have in my collection than the lightning one i feel like with the lightning one i usually use 
three drops. Um, they have half of an ounce, each one of them, and they retail for $20. The cover effects one, they're $44, and as I mentioned before, I mean, it's half an ounce as well, but they have different shades, so it might be something different that you want to try. Now, for this one in particular, something that I want to mention, because I think that this is one of my... It was my number one question when I was looking at this product. Is this going to change the undertone of my foundation? Uh, no, this is not going to change the undertone. It's going to make it lighter or it's going to make it darker, but it's not going to change the undertone. So if you have a foundation that it's orange, you might as well, you know, try to lighten and make it work for you or just get rid of it. But it's not going to get rid of that orange undertone. It's just going to lighten the foundation but it's not going to mess with the formula. So if it oxidizes, it, it will oxidize on you. It's not going to change the formula. It's just going to lighten the foundation that you mix it with or you're going to darken the, your foundation. It, Whatever it is, it's not going to change how the foundation performs on your skin. And when you mix it with, for example, another foundation, you mix, you mix two foundations, then you have to make sure that they work together because you do change the formula. With this one, I didn't notice that it changed any of the formulas of the foundation. So that might be a great thing for you because if you have a foundation that you like, for example, in my case, I want to try the Physician's Formula, the one that it has a dropper, but I don't have, I mean, it's really light. I can't make it work for me, the medium color. So with this one, I can apply, you know, one or two drops and make it darker and make it work for me. And that way I can try the formula that I really been wanting to try for a long time but maybe if you have the same problem as I do that it's hard to find the perfect shade of foundation then you may want to try this either for lightening or darkening your foundations and make it work for you because for me it's one of my pet peeves if it doesn't match my neck then it's one of those things that it really really bothers me and sometimes when I'm here in camera the light reflects a different way on my foundation that it does on my <laughs> neck and that kind of bothers me but in real life I really take the time to make sure that it matches because I don't want to look like darker skin and then you know lighter neck or you know vice versa but I just want to make sure that it's a perfect shade so for me it's totally worth it if you have the perfect foundation which you know what's your perfect shade you know that it works all day you know that it doesn't matter if it's winter or summer it's always going to be the perfect shade for you then you probably don't need this product but if you are like me trying to pan products in your collection that it may not be the perfect shade for you or if you have a, a, that specific foundation that you absolutely love you love the formula the texture the longevity everything Thing, but you can't seem to make it work any of the colors then this might be a cheaper alternative or those you know drops to change your foundation shade so I hope that this video wasn't too confusing but it gave you good information on and this specific ones I know the body shop is one of those brands that is very popular and I know that probably most of you are aware about this but I just wanted to let you know about those things you know maybe those questions that I had before I try them so if you're new to my channel remember to subscribe so you won't miss any new videos Monday through Fridays if you want to check out prices or anything the links will be in the description box down below and if you're a youtuber and you want to check out octoly where you can get products to review for free then i'll link their website in the description box down below as well so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video